Bukta Hawa, Bukta Shai, Bukta Hawa, Bukta Shai, Ka Halayim La Yahawa, Bashem, Yao Shai, Bashem, Ka Kadash. Yahweh is the true, holy, powerful, all name of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. Yahweh Shai is the true, holy, powerful, all name of His only God Son, Yahweh Shai, which is our Lord and Savior. The Thaum Masana Kabbalah has cream, so as Allah, which means give double honors to the elders of Israel, which is the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who teach you well. Shalom wa hala pakia sa jala, which means peace and love to the elect of Israel. Come on with you another lesson. And kind of be like responding to this, man. You can see the name of this is a uh, liberal church forced whites to repent, you know? So, yeah, in this video, Esau so called apologizing, man. And it's, and it's too late for that shit, man, to be real with you, man. And ultimately, the Lord. The Lord, Yahweh Shai, though doesn't want your apology, you know? What you done to us is a nation and just you you took it too far, man. Yo, you we know that you are the whooping stick of the most high. You is the sword, you know, but you took it too far, you know. So right, so Esau Edom, it's too late for apology. Ultimately, we don't want your apology, man. You can keep it, man. Ultimately the elect, the hundred and forty four thousand. Don't doesn't want your apology, man. You know? It, it's too late for that. And ultimately, the Lord, Yahweh Shai, our Lord and Savior, doesn't want your apology, man. You got to pay back. You know? It's payback, man. And and the spirit of the Lord is is out here now, man. The truth is coming out, man. Now you want to apologize. You know, it's 2019. Now you want to apologize. You know, for all the crimes, the torture, rape, rob, murders, you know? To, to the Israelites, man, to Jake, the so-called blacks, Hispanic, Latinos, and Native American Indians, man, to us, man. It's good to say, him that touches you touches the apple of his eye, man. So with that, we're just going to get into it, man. How the Lord doesn't want your apology, you know. Let's we'll start with Amos 1 and 11. It said, uh, Thus said the Lord, Yahweh, for three transgressions of, e of Edom, and for four, I will not, I will not turn away the punishment thereof. Because he did pursue his brother with the sword. Right. You read that in on, on the book of Genesis, man. Jacob versus Esau, man. You know? It said he did pursue his brother with the sword. And did cast off all pity. And his anger did tell perpetually. And he kept his wrath forever. Right? He kept his wrath forever. Until this day, man. You know? That's why racism would, not, would never go away, you know? We were all, you know, the so-called white man, Esau Edom, would always hate Jacob, man. You know, which is which is our so-called Negroes, Black, Hispanic, Latinos, and Native American Indians, man. You know, that hate would never go away, man, until he be destroyed, man. You read the book of Obadiah, you know. Right, so, let's get the um, Romans 12, 19, man. But the Lord ain't turning away your punishment, man. You got to drink out that cup, you know. This woman 12 and 19, daily beloved, avenge not yourselves, you know. But rather give place unto wrath, for it is written, vengeance is mine, I will pay, said the Lord, you know. So the Lord going to pay you back, man. Pay you back double, man. You know, what's the Lord vengeance, man? Like the book of Isaiah 63. And one, it said, who is that that coming from Edom who dyed garments from Basel? This is this that is glorious in his appear, traveling in the greatness of his strength. I that speak in righteousness, mighty to save. And who is mighty to save? You know? Verse 2. Wherefore art thou red in thy appear, and thy garments like him that treaded in the wine fed alone? I have trodden the wine press alone, and of the people there was none with me. But I will tread them in my anger, and trample them in my fury. And their blood should be sprinkled, sprinkled upon my garments, and I will stain all my raiment. Right, man. This is the Lord speaking, man. You know, Esau Adam, you gotta pay, man. You know? It's a uh verse four. For the day of vengeance is in my heart, and the year of my redeem is come. Right. The, hey, the Lord vengeance is his heart, man. You know what you did to him, you know, two thousand years ago? You know, he, he he has he hasn't forgotten about that, man. You know? He hasn't forgotten about that. You know? And he he also hasn't forgotten about slavery, man. 
You know? So let's get um, one more scripture. I'm close up. It's like Exodus 17. And, um, I'm going to start at 14. And the Lord said unto Moses, Write this for a memorial in a book and rehearse it in the ears of Joshua. For I will utterly put out the remembrance of Amalek from under heaven. Right? Who is Amalek? The grandson of Esau, man. Amalek, the so-called fake Jews in our homeland now in Israel. You know? The, hey, the Lord hate Amalek, man. That's the top nation of Israel. Uh, it's like oh, Esau, you know? Amalek, this, uh, you know? Esau eat them. And Moses built an altar and called the name of it Yahweh, Yahweh Nazar. He looked that up in the Hebrew, you know? Verse 16. For he said, because the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahshua has sworn that the Lord Yahweh will have war with Amalek from generation to generation. You know? So Esau, you know, is not done away with, man. You know? <laughs> this it, man. So the Lord had declared war on Amalek, man, on the so-called white people. You know? Hey, the Lord doesn't want your apology, man. You know? It's plain and simple. So, yeah, so with that, man, just going to how the Lord and not dealing with... <laughs> Your apologies, man. You know? Because what it's saying, Hebrews, you know, well, I don't got to get it. Hebrews 10 16, you know? So, with that, help you edify once again. I want to give our praises and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Kakudash. I want to give that honor to the apostles and others a great millstone with this reward. And I want to say peace and love to the lake of Israel. With that, Shalom, Kwame Allah, Wa Baba.